Well, climate change always on Matt's mind, but mm -hmm. this week in particular. Yeah, so this afternoon, Matt, you have a look at the impact right here in the Northwest. I do, and we're doing this this week. First of all, what I'm showing you is the rainbow that's in downtown Portland from our Wells Fargo Skycam. I mean, talk about changing weather. Just beautiful. We had a strong shower go across Portland. That's moving off to the east, and now we have that rainbow. But the reason we're focusing on climate change all week is because NBC News is focusing on climate change all week. They're calling their series or their week climate in crisis, so we thought we would dovetail with that. And what I'm going to try to do is focus on local and regional issues uh, for the week. So starting with that, climate change in the Northwest. One way to look at it is with snowpack. This is research that was done by the Natural Resource Conservation Service, the California Department of Water Resources, and researchers down at Oregon State University. And this is looking at changes in snowpack from 1955 to 2014. And basically, if you look at the key here, the bigger the circle and the darker the orange or red you go, the less snow we're seeing. And almost throughout the West, we're seeing less snowpack, except at some of the sites in the Sierra Nevada. It's very elevation dependent, though. We are seeing some increases in precipitation, but unless you're way up high, most of that is being realized as rain. So having less snow throughout the course of the season has big impacts, not only for recreation, but for water supply and for fish. Now, here's another way of looking at that. This is looking forward, looking on the left hand side, historic snowpack, right hand side, mid 21st century. Here's the way to look at this where you see red and white. That's historically been snow where you see blue. Historically, it's rain. Notice how the blue areas take over and the red and the white shrink on that side as we go forward. And this is consistent with many, many researchers and many, many climate models This put together by Kloss and others back in 2015. So to sum it up, Impacts already happening here in the Northwest. Most researchers believe they are likely to increase as we go forward in the next several decades. And if you want to learn more, there's a great conference coming up next month in Portland. It's called the Northwest Climate Conference, bringing together climate researchers, people that deal with water and natural resource issues all here in Portland. That's later in October. And there's the website. We'll talk more about this as the week goes on as well. Ladies, back to you. All right. So important, Matt. Thank you.